Lawrence Fishburne takes a playful jab at the world's most controversial pop star. No, no, not Miley, the other one. The brilliant actor stopped by The View on Tuesday to discuss his new ABC sitcom, Blackish, which the critics are loving, by the way. And if my apartment caught on fire, I would run out with my baby book and my DVR because, of all things, I can now not live without a weekly dose of Blackish and Fishburne. Anyway, that's when Lawrence let his real feelings on Justin sort of shine through. So, okay, first of all, in case you haven't even seen the show, Blackish centers on an upper class black family whose kids struggle to identify with black culture. Now, the diss all started when Lawrence was asked to explain the title of the show, and he was saying how Blackish can refer to black people trying to act white or white people trying to act black. And then he said this I think of it this way two words, Justin Bieber. <gasps> You know, Justin Bieber acts blackish, but he doesn't get shot by the police. He gets a police escort home. So the hosts, Rosie Perez and Whoopi Goldberg, seemed equally shocked by his response. However, it's all good in the hood. He did not mean to burn Justin. In fact, he added, if you like rock and roll, if you like rhythm and blues, if you like jazz, if you like hip hop, you might be blackish. I'm so blackish, I'm purple then, because I listen to Louis Armstrong and D'Angelo like they are going out of style. You know what? Some people say that everyone is just a little bit gay, while I think that everyone is just a little bit blackish. Mm hmm. Right, Lawrence? <laughs> right. All right, now what do you guys think of this new term, blackish? And does Biebs fall in that category? Comment below or tweet me at Clever News, at Miriam Issa, and then click right over here to see a list of all the celebs who have dissed Justin Bieber. Make sure that you guys subscribe. I'm your host, Miriam Issa. Thank you so much for checking out Clever News, and we'll see you guys around. Thank mm -hmm. you.